Hey, welcome back to the show. We're so excited to have you with us today. We've got an exciting guest who is somewhat of a recent celebrity in our community. You may not know his name, but you'll know his face. Please welcome Larry Roger. Larry, it's so good to have you with us today. Thanks. Good to be here. Well, we're captivated by your recent statement where on the news you said this, and I quote, Jesus is still alive. That's right. That's right. Where is he then? If he's still alive, how come no one's seen him in so many years? You ain't never read your Bible, have you? I just purchased a brand new Bible this morning on the way to work. I'm going to take it home and read it this weekend. You ain't going to read it in a weekend. Oh, but I'm a very fast reader. You don't read the Bible for speed. How you going to get any nourishment out of the Word if you don't take time to chew on it, savor it a little bit? Well, I don't understand. What do you mean by chewing on it? The scripture says, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who puts his trust in the Lord. Well, I certainly don't trust anybody, that's for sure. A whole lot of folks in this world don't trust. Well, they put their trust in the wrong things or the wrong people. Well, tell me, Larry, why should I trust in your God? Because he loves you. Oh, <laughs> I've heard that before. But have you ever seen true love's greatest demonstration? I guess not. Let me show you. When they were come to the place, which is called Calvary, there they crucified him. And the male factors, one on the right hand and one on the left, then said Jesus, Father, forgive them. For they know not what they do. Jesus was born to die on his way to the cross to redeem me and you and all the people of the world, his own people rejected him. One of his closest friends betrayed him. Another close friend denied him three times. The Romans whipped him and beat him almost to death and then nailed him to a cross. He begged God, begged God to forgive them. Why would someone do such a thing? Because sin brings death. Hell's still hot. The man can't save himself. Everybody needs God's grace and forgiveness. I see. Well, friends, that's all the time we have for our show today. Please tune in again tomorrow when our very special guest will be Jeremy Foster of Foster's Fish Fry and Fritter Factory.